Hey guys, I came to fix my nails. So I can't fix my nails. You, let me. I said let me tell you something before, before I go in there, before I take these nails off. Every time I fix my nails, mm, I'm always prone to accidents. I'm always prone to hitting my my hand. Um, you know how it is when you fix your nails and then you hit it somewhere by mistake. That pain, eh? It is a touch inside the brain. It is a touch somewhere along the lines of the brain every other time i've been fixing my nail i've been hitting my hands there was one time eh? hey god in one week all five fingers were aching me i know that eh? depending on the intensity of how you hit that finger and the intensity of the pain that you feel sometimes your hand will be troubled your finger will be troubling for maybe two or three days so imagine having one hand always in pain but i said that i'm not gonna stop fixing i'm just always going to fix and i will always be careful so when I fixed this one, as I was fixing it, I said, let me pray. As I was fixing them, I was just talking to God while the technician was walking. I was telling God to please help me. Let your girl not be in pain. Let these nails that I'm fixing not cause me pain or make me uncomfortable. I was just praying to God that he should help me. Help me with these nails. Guess what? For the three and a half weeks that I carried these nails, not one incident not one as in hitting my hand anywhere and i could tell that god was actually paying attention to me and how i use this hand because these hands because i would actually be careless and hit it but it won't be intense it would be like a very light touch and my mind would tell me that this was god do that god is paying attention that god is helping you I said that this is a testimony you might think it's a small thing that what am i talking about is it not just nail well, let me tell you there's something i've learned something i've learned early this year that we are even though we're just in the second month of the year something i learned i was listening to um, apostle joshua selman and he said that every testimony everything that has the hand of god in it deserves giving him glory for don't say it's a very tiny testimony that is inconsequential that who we care about this testimony that it doesn't really really make any much of sense that is it not just this is it not just that that lets you leave the the testimonies for those that have profound miracles let me tell you i don't take anything for granted anymore this the fact that i did not feel any pain i didn't stop my hand hit my hand anywhere for the duration of the time that i carry these nails is a miracle to me i don't take it for granted so i came here to share the the testimony with you people before i carry on with my vlog all right i'm going to fix my nails something enter inside my eye something enter inside my eye and it's making me very uncomfortable okay let me do my nails i'm not going to carry along i'm just going to show you when i'm done all right all right bye i'm done my new manicure it's not it's not fine in the video but it's fine in real life it's gorgeous in real life but i don't know why it's not fine in this video it's the lighting maybe because the sun is too bright but i'm done and i love it i love this color so much all right let me go where i'm going whose car is shouting whose car is shouting here i need to go find where i can do photocopy i want to make no not photocopy i want to print some documents and i need to go find where I can print them. Ciao! Tomorrow is Valentine's Day, so I bought this gift for Zite's class. I bought it for her class because we're supposed to bring gifts for for her classmates. She has eight eight um friends, rather not eight friends, eight people in her class. And then I bought these bags to put them in. I initially didn't want to buy bags. So I wanted to just take the gifts, carry it in this bag, then the teacher will share it. But then I went to CVS. I saw these bags, they looked so cute, I couldn't resist, and they come in different colors, so I, hey, 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 shut up! So, they come in different colors, and then I had to get them, so I want to pack them in the bags now, alright? So, we finished, we finished, the bags are ready, yay, 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 woo, 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 me, to go, give me, no, 
Okay, so we finished packing the bags. The bags are ready. I can't. I don't want to label them because um, everything in here is basically the same thing. There is nothing for a special gender, so everything is the same. No need to label. Besides, I don't even know the names of everybody in her class. Okay, no, I do. I do. <laughs> All right, guys. See you later. Let me show you guys something. I like seeing all these tiny, tiny things. They are so cute. This is the face scrub. So tiny. See? Cleanser. Cetaphil cleanser. See this one? Cetaphil lotion. So tiny. It's the traveling section. That's why all these things are here. Even all these, all these empty containers in case you want to put stuff in it and travel with them. It just caught my eye. Tiny, tiny stuff. Tiny micellar water. Oh, oh yeah, I found what I'm looking for. This right here. Yeah. This right here is what I came here for. Okay, have a nice day. Let's go. Look at the end. Guys, so I ain't on a Costco. We came to Costco. Let me show you. I came to use my gift certificate. Remember that last year I got a hundred and something dollars. This year I got ninety ninety dollars nineteen cents. So that's why we are here. And like I told Dindo, I don't like buying things like food that you eat and then we put it out or we will eat out. I want to buy something that we'll keep in the house. That we'll keep in the house and always use. So right now I'm confused. Jane Joseph doesn't know. Do you, do you have any ideas of what we can get? <laughs> huh? I don't have any. I have I have one thought do. Uh, I want microfiber cloths, a pack mm -hmm. of microfiber cloths that but I don't know where my sister usually gets it from. But we'll find it. That's why we're here. Let's is go. Eh? How much is it? I don't know how much it is now. When we find it, we'll know. The Let's go. I can see. Let's go. Then is asking if it's like cloth that we used to... Is it like wipes? It's not wipes. You know, it's that, that um, blue cloth we use in the kitchen to wipe surfaces. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So that's the microfiber cloth. So we need the one that comes in in a big pack. It's not here, Joe. Come. Come this way. It's not where I thought it would be. Let's look. I'm thinking it should be here. Do you, do you know that the glass cleaner comes in spray too, like this? I didn't know. You see, they have all these scrubbing things. All these scrubbing things. Then oh, you should like have this? it here. Like this? No, no, it's not like this. I'm saying that it should be in this area. It should be in this on this aisle. Are you sure it's even this Costco? Maybe it's the other Costco. The big oh. one. The big Costco. Huh. Let's go this way. PE drink? PE? Huh? PE drink? A what? PE drink. Like, like drink. For for drink. Yeah, it's like Drink. Yeah, like. I told you we're not buying drink. It's for exercising. I'm not buying. Uh, that's not why. That's not what I want to buy with it. Then we might end up going to the other Costco. We might end up going to the bigger Costco. Let me tell you something. A oh, wonderful. You see these flushable wipes? Don't be deceived. It will block your toilet. It will block it. It doesn't need to. It doesn't need to dissolve. It will block it. Mm. You have to call plumber. They will now bring snake plunger to open up your toilet. So ignore this thing. Then you got a paper towel. Over there. Okay. I
Honestly, I shouldn't Caught up in my feelings So this is the kind I bought the last time? Yeah Forty-four dollars so far. Okay. What else? That's it. No, pencil. Yeah, and then I need um other spray, Lysol spray for. That's it. I see it over there. I'm in the deep end. The waves are washing over. I know I'm not sober. Can I come closer? I wanna come over. When you leave me like that. We did it! We did it! <laughs> you people! We did this! I said I'm not spending an extra dime apart from that um, Costco gift certificate. When we finished packing everything in the car the first time, we went to go and pay the added tax of how much tax again? Eight dollars something. Mm -hmm. We say, please, can we go back and go and reshuffle re and change some things? Cancel the transaction. We went back and removed something. But you see, paper towel. I got two paper towels, two bags of paper towels. I cannot do without paper towels. I don't know about you, but I can't do without it. Dindu was wondering that why do we have to buy two bags of paper towels? We need it. I think that's the item we use most of all in our house because we're always wiping, always cleaning hands, always washing and, and wiping. I don't like wet hands. I don't like wet stuff. So, paper towels. And paper towels that we used to buy, do you know how much we used to buy paper towel before, Dindo? Was it not about $11 something? Mm. Now it's $19.39. Even in Agalagon, it's just so disheartening. Everything is now expensive. Anyway, let me end this vlog right now. Our shopping was a success it's only five see only five items only five items that we bought cost 90 dollars 88 dollars only five items anyway sha we are gonna see ourselves in the next vlog kill zills i gotta tell you something i could do i could be running or i'm chasing you but i won't because i got better better things to do I spent my precious time